Sure, I'd love to. It looks great. Mm. This uh, looks... maybe. I'll... for my blade. That's a real beast of a monster. Tough one. Okay. Here I go. Now. An opening. Let's move. Sit. Here I go.
close to me! Hey! Now's our chance! Got you! I'll handle it. Here I go! Sit! I'll handle it. Too slow! I'll back you up! My turn! Of course! Huh? My turn. Stay alert, everyone! That should suffice. Oh, look! There's a treasure chest! Challengers. I'll handle it. Here I go. Let's move. The battle's over, but stay alert, everyone. Looks now a worthy adversary. My turn. Here I go. Got it. I'll back you up. My turn. Now's our chance. An opening. You're finished. Of course. Mark is activate. My turn. Leave this to me. I leave this to you. I'll show you how it's done. Now's our chance. Don't let it pass. Right. Yeah, of course. Now. My turn. Okay. My turn. Now. I'll back you up. Of course. Arcus, activate. Here I go. Too slow. I'll back you up. Now. Stay alert, everyone. I'm so glad. <laughs> I've only just begun. That's a real. This one looks dangerous! Be careful! My turn. Here I go. My turn. Huh. 
I'll handle this. Now's our chance. Don't let it pass. Right? Yeah, understood. My turn. My turn. Now's our chance. Don't let it pass. Leave it to me. to me. My turn. I leave this to you. Understood. Shatter. Of course. Arcus, activate. Let's move. Ha! Now's our chance. An opening. Okay. Stay alert, everyone. Success. I did it! For my blade. Stay on guard. Watch out! This is a tough one! My turn! Sorry, I'll show you how it's done. My turn. Now's our chance. Don't let it pass! Understood. Understood! My turn. Now's our chance. Don't let it pass! Right. Leave, Leave it, it to me. me! Your turn! Curse you! This to you. I've got this. Ha! Now! An 
coming. Okay. One, two, ha, and death. For my blade. Hmm. Not bad. Huh? Thank goodness. <laughs> Naturally. Another elevator. <sighs> that must lead us to the castle's highest point, the Vermilion Throne. What should we do? The only thing we can do. This marks the end of our investigation. We can't go onward with just us, though. We need to call the others. Class 7's only truly complete when all of us are together. It wouldn't be right to have them wait downstairs while we finish things up. Of course! Agreed. No matter the outcome, our journey ends here. <laughs> it's tempting to feel nostalgic about how far we've come at this point, but that can wait until we're celebrating our victory. <laughs> well, just make sure you're completely ready before stepping onto it.
you really came. Welcome all to our tale's grand finale. We're here, Crow. Hard to believe it's been less than three weeks since we last met. <laughs> You're telling me. You all look so grown up now. All those ordeals you put yourself through have paid off in spades. That's certainly one way to look at it. As much as I hate to admit it, I doubt we could win against you otherwise. The trials we faced brought us together and made us stronger. I couldn't be more pleased with what we had to do to come this far. I was finally able to move forward too. So yeah, I like to think I grew up a bit. <laughs> a lot of stuff's changed, but you guys ain't one of them. And that's not all. We're here on behalf of Toa, Angelica, and George too. I promised them I'd bring you back and force you to graduate with them. And it's a promise I intend to keep. Oh man, give me a break. You're telling me you've done all that and it still hasn't dawned on you. Get it through your thick skull, it's not gonna happen. <laughs> That's not true, Crow. Those who are confronted with impossible odds can choose to react in one of two ways. Abandon hope and accept a pitiful fate. Or cling to that hope and forge ahead, overcoming any and all that life throws their way. That's what it means to dream. <laughs> Vida. She's absolutely right. Maybe we are just young and naive. But if anything, I feel that it was our youth and naivete that allowed us to come this far to begin with. And we've done it without losing a single member along the way, carrying the hopes of everyone we've met with us. I'd say that's pretty amazing, wouldn't you? And for that, I don't see any harm in dreaming of the tomorrow that we all want to come. No one can say that the chances of it happening are zero, after all. <sighs> and all things considered, I'm in something of a difficult position as well. So I sincerely hope you don't think yourself some special snowflake compared to the rest of us. <laughs> yeah, join the club! My background's all weird too, so spit it out! Tell us what you really want. You can deal with all the crappy stuff later. Honestly. <laughs> you may have joined the Academy to stop people from working out your true identity, sure. But you made a big mistake by letting yourself get wrapped up with a bunch of softies like Class 7. Yeah, no kidding. You guys would haunt me to the ends of the Earth, wouldn't you? Hmm. <laughs> My, what a touching spectacle. You work tirelessly to pursue the impossible together. You lose yourself in the passion of the moment. Innocence truly is the privilege of the young. Duke Cayenne. Oh, that's His Highness the Crown Prince. He's been blindfolded. Have you no shame? And what's that huge red thing behind him? That's the Vermilion Knight, Testarossa. It was sealed away under the capital a long time ago, and it was responsible for countless calamities. It's often referred to as the demon which wields a thousand weapons. And to expand on what Emma said, the ones who supposedly sealed it away were Dreykel's the Lionheart and the Lance Maiden. Ha <laughs> ha! It certainly was. And the only ones capable of rousing it from its slumber are descendants of the Honored Bloodline. Thus, why His Highness has so graciously chosen to cooperate with us. <sighs> Duke Cayenne, surely you realize how utterly disrespectful you are being. I have a little dream of my own, you see. A dream my ancestor was unable to reach in his lifetime. One that I will make a reality in his place. A dream? What ancestor? Wait, was this ancestor alive during the War of the Lions? Precisely! Emperor Orthros Rice Arnor, born to the first of the Emperor's secondary wives, the daughter of a duke. 
He occupied Heimdall at the time of the War of the Lions, but fell to Dreykos and became known as the False Emperor. And I inherit his blood. Possible. I had no idea that the Kayan family were descendants of the False Emperor. <laughs> Hardly a surprise. When the war came to a close, that truth was buried. I suppose it was Emperor Dreykel's way of trying to avoid any further conflict among the nobles. But not a day, not one day in all these years has my family forgotten the sheer humiliation. And so I dreamed of a future where I would take back the Vermilion Knight and this infernal castle. The proofs of ownership over this city that Emperor Orthros had disgracefully stripped away. <gasps> that's all? You occupied Heimdall and started a civil war and that's your reason? Well, the Chancellor's death was desirable regardless, and the Society's diva provided invaluable assistance. The Imperial Liberation Front proved to be serviceable pawns. The Azure Awakener managed to awaken his knight. The time was right in all regards. Only a fool would idly watch this moment pass. I did intend to operate the Vermilion Knight myself, but as I feared, only those of direct descent are capable of doing so. And yet it matters not. I have everything I need to return this city to its original, rightful form as His Highness's guardian. Once my will is done, I shall restore order to Erebonia, returning it to the way it once was and always should have been. That is my ambition. My family's destiny. What nonsense. He doesn't care about anyone but himself. I'm afraid I can't even pretend to care about your ambitions. It's not my place to decide how Erebonia should be run, and I'm not here to lecture you on your ancestors' transgressions. Oh? We have our own ambitions. We're here because we promised Princess Alvin and Prince Oliver that we would rescue their brother from your clutches. And if putting a stop to your dream is what it takes to save His Highness the Crown Prince, then that's exactly what we'll do. You impudent little... <sighs> I think everyone has said their piece now. You won't be going back on your word to let us handle this part, right? Huh. Do as you wish. It should provide some light entertainment until the ritual is complete. I expect to be amused. We could skip right to using our knights, but might as well savor the moment while we still can, right? So for the opening act, I'll fight you as I am now. Crow versus Class 7. Crow. <laughs> Very well. And I'll be fighting alongside him. Seeing as how you have the famed purple lightning with you, it wouldn't be much of a fair fight otherwise. Aw, you flatter me. Sadly, I trust your idea of a fair fight about as much as I trust me missing a point-blank shot. <laughs> oh, do excuse me. Emma, I want you to fight with everything you have. We'll see whether you have the resolve necessary to shoulder a witch's burden. Don't worry, I will. Not because of the duty I've been given but to demonstrate the limitless potential I've found within myself. As the last remaining member and leader of the Imperial Liberation Front, I'm gonna make our very last fight one to remember. And as the one tasked with guiding you to the end, I think it's time I did just that. A combat link? They can do that? It makes no difference to us. Class 7, ready yourselves! Because Combat Link or not, I know we'll triumph! Right! right. right. This is it! Come at me with all you've got! Witness the witchcraft of the Azure Abyss! My turn. Huh. Very well. 
Now's our chance. Don't let it pass. Leave, Leave it, to, it, me. it to, me. to me. Very well. Very well. Holy shit. Protect us! <laughs> My turn. <laughs> My turn. No one should win this. My turn. Now's our chance. Don't let it pass. Understood. Okay. Let's move. Huh. Let's move. All right, let's do this. Understood. Let's move. All right, let's do this. Leave this to me. Witness the fruits of my training. How about this? No problem. Pants. I can do this. Light. Rain upon us. I can do this. Sorry, would you mind? I'll take it from here. My turn. My turn. Huh. 
You have my face. Thank you very much. Very well. My turn. Now's our chance. Don't let it pass. Leave it to me. Very well. My turn. Holy shit. Protect us! I'll handle this. Now's our chance! Don't let it pass! Leave it to me! Here we go! Here goes! Overdrive! Of me. The battle's over, but stay alert, everyone. Huh? Thank goodness. <laughs> A matter of course. Great. Hmm. Not bad. Success. I feel stronger than ever. <laughs> Naturally. Oh my, I didn't see this coming. <sighs> what I tell you, don't underestimate my classmates. They're a tough crowd for being all dreams and sunshine. <laughs> so they are. Crow? Vita? Ah, enough of this nonsense! I need not remind you how if you were to lose against them, our contract would- Butt out, you. I- I beg your pardon? All right, let's wrap this up. This is it, Reen. You ready for the finale? Ready? I was waiting on you. He... Valamar, the Ashen Knight! I go.
is a battle between Awakeners. None should interfere. She's right. All we can do is watch. <sighs> it's frustrating to be unable to help. But if we must... We'll just have to put our trust in Reen. Is that the sword you forged from Zemirian Ore? Pretty impressive. Guess I don't have to hold back anymore. <sighs> hmm? What, you getting cold feet or something? Yeah, I think I am. Regardless of whether I win or I lose, this is the end. And I can't help but get this nagging feeling like things will never be the same between us after this. So spoiled. The future you want is only gonna happen by making the most of the present. Whatever happened to dragging me back to the academy and forcing me to graduate? <sighs> You're right. This time, I'm not going to hold back. This isn't a fight for this nation's future. It's got nothing to do with our classmates. This is a fight for me. Right now, all that matters to me is surpassing you! <laughs> I wouldn't have it any other way. Divine Knights are all about power, pure and simple. You shouldn't have to think about your feelings. They should just be a part of you. And just as a blacksmith pours his soul into forging a stronger sword, you should use those feelings to strengthen your resolve. Okay, we've talked long enough. Let's go. I won't let anyone interfere. This is going to be our final battle. That's exactly how I want it to be. We'll fight until we can fight no more. Until our strength runs dry and our souls burn out. <laughs>
working. Keep it up. It's my turn. Can you handle this? I'll try at least. Try at least. Try this! Darkness! Clean! Gotcha! Let's go! Gotcha! Time! Hope you're ready! Can you handle this? Understood.
can handle this.
my turn. Let me! Leave it to me. I'm sorry. Can you handle Understood. this? Understood. Help! Gotcha! Let's go! Go for three! Leave it to me! Did it? He won? Yep, I think the victor is clear. The battle goes to Reen. <laughs> yes, he did it! He really won. I'm so happy. Unbelievable. You fought splendidly, Reen. Yourself. It's okay. I'm fine. Green! Hey guys, thanks for believing in me. It means a lot. Of course we did. It was pretty nerve-wracking though. <laughs> Still, I knew that you would be able to win if you put your heart into it. Indeed. I felt the same way. <laughs> You two were in your own little world, you know. <laughs> True. I don't think we could have interfered even if we wanted to. Where'd you pull all those cheesy lines from, anyway? How inspiring. I won't let anyone interfere, and we'll fight until our souls burn out, hmm? Have you ever considered, I don't know, reading the atmosphere? <laughs> <laughs> Man, I love you kids. <laughs> you should take it easy for now. You Honestly, it's got nothing to do with our classmates, he says. And then what does he do? He goes and pulls off Arcus links with him perfectly mid-battle. Kind of contradicting yourself, don't you think? <laughs> yeah, maybe. I didn't do it on purpose, though. I just did it unconsciously. I guess all their feelings have become a part of me at this point. My classmates, Valimars, probably even yours, Crow. <gasps> now isn't that something? Form is emptiness, emptiness is form. 
you reach the point where you can feel others as a part of yourself. Congrats on getting a glimpse of the true heights of swordsmanship. No, it's a little hard to describe. It was almost as if I was dreaming. I just did it without thinking. I'm not sure I would be able to do the same thing again, to be honest. You've got to be kidding me. Oh, Reen. Well, there's a letdown. Honestly, I couldn't agree more. <laughs> oh, well. Seems like you've still got a long way to go before reaching those heights, much like the rest of us. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, you don't need to laugh that much. <laughs> I swear, there's no room for debate with you, is there? You beat me. Fair and square. Beyond a shadow of a doubt. <sighs> Sorry about this, Vita. After you did so much for me, I ended up letting you down. <laughs> oh, don't trouble your pretty head over that. True, this wasn't what I had in mind, but I'm perfectly content with happy endings. What? Enough of this! What is the meaning of this, witch? Do you mean to suggest that is all you intend to do? Oh, I forgot he was there. Duke Cayenne? Haha, <laughs> yeah, same here. Totally forgot. From the beginning, the Society's objective was to prepare this stage for its participants. I seem to recall telling you I had no interest in anything other than the battle between Azure and Ashen. Did you forget, perhaps? <sighs> Vita? But what was the point in this battle to begin? Silence! You will be silent! If that's how you want to be, then I'll simply have to do things my own way! He can't mean... Wait! Don't do it! Come now, your highness. The time has come to rule with force. Let the ancient honor blood course feverishly through your veins. No! Please! Please! Your highness! You monster! How could you? No, it sucked him in. <gasps> what the? Rosa at its core. The Vermilion Apocalypse.
Master Patrick, stay on guard! It's... it's as if something is being taken away from us. But what? Ugh. That load of good swords are gonna do against whatever this is. Well, don't you stand there. You know some way to deal with this, don't you? D don't look at me! Though I guess this is no time to be feigning ignorance. These red spirit veins around us are meant to siphon mana. Focus your energy and stay vigilant, and you should be able to mitigate the effects to some extent. I see. Makes sense. In that case... Everyone, take a deep breath and gather your energy in your abdomen. And stay focused. This isn't over yet. Yes, yes sir! Help me make an opening. An opening? With that enhancement technique? Yep. The same one you used on me in that trial three years back. You think it'll work? It's worth a try. Crow? You got something in mind? I think so. Vita and I are gonna try to make an opening so you can get closer. Once we've done that, try and hold out against it as much as you can. You can do that? If you can, please do. We're done for if we don't try something. So I say go for it. Still, it sounds like all that's going to do is delay the inevitable. We're going to need something more decisive to turn the tides in our favor. Of course, the Divine Knights. If you combine their strength, we could actually make it through this thing. Now you think, if we can hold out till they've recovered a good chunk of mana, Victory's as good as ours. After that, all we gotta do is separate the core, Crown Prince Cedricson, from the rest of the body. No sweat! We can do this! Right. Without him, it shouldn't be able to remain in this dimension any longer. Not like we got any better options. Okay, let's go! Vita, Crow, we're counting on you! Leave it to us! 
We won't disappoint. Grianos, Celine, would you two mind helping? <sighs> Fine, if I have to. Your breath, which arises from the abyss. Reside within his blade and cleave through the vermilion flames. Take this! Deadly! Cross! Now's our chance! Class 7, let's go! Right! right. right. Stay calm. We can get through this. Okay! My turn. You handle. 
handle this with pleasure. My form! Now! I'll back you up! My turn. Sorry, no problem. Time barrier. Break! Leave it to me. Okay. Keep it up, everyone. All right. Fight for ah! Oh, please. This, this can't be happening. Leave it to me. turn.
my turn. Got this. Ha! Now! You're mine! My turn. I'm bringing the thunder now. Here I go! Ha! Now! Let's go, everyone! Right, right, okay. Leave it to me! <laughs> it's my turn! Keep it up, everyone! Leave it to me. My fourth! Leave it to me! Huh? You didn't see that coming! Let's move! Let's move! Here I go! Alright, let's do this! Leave it to me! Leave it to me! Leave it to me! Leave it to me! My fork! Right! Keep it up, everyone! Leave it to me! I'm gonna slice you up! My turn! Ha! My turn! I'm gonna slice you up! All right. Take this. Let's move. All right, let's do this. Leave it to me. Okay. okay. Keep it up, everyone. Leave it to me. It's my turn. Right. My turn.
Here I go. My plate will cleave ignorance and light the way. turn. this.
Here it goes. My turn. My turn. Thanks. Thank you very much. Very well. My turn. Holy shield. Protect us! My turn. Very well. Now's our chance. Don't let it pass. Leave it, it to me! I'll handle this. Now's our chance. Don't let it pass. Leave Understood. it to me. Understood. My turn. Second form. Damn. Leave this to you. Will do. Here I go. Now. There. Ah. Too slow. Now. Let's get this over with. I'll handle right. this. Right. Very well. I'll handle this. Very well. Now's our chance. Don't let it pass. Yes. Give it to me. Of course. Arcus, activate. Ha. Let's move.
here! Thanks! I can do this! I'll handle this. Very well. Now's our chance. Don't let it pass. Leave it to me. Very well. Now's our chance. Don't let it pass. Of course. Of course. Here I go.
gotcha. Sick. its core, with the Crown Prince in it. I'll clear a path. You focus on rescuing. Got it! Scratch me. 
You keep going. You're the only one who can save him now. So don't you dare look back! Right! Eight beats, one play, seven four. And what is domination? He's exhausted, but his life doesn't appear to be in any danger. Yeah, he's lost a lot of mana, but nothing that would prove fatal. He'll be alright with some rest. Oh. oh thank goodness. Oh, that's a relief. That's our mission complete. We recovered the other one of this nation's greatest treasures. Oh. This... this can't be... Oh, I can't believe how wrong this has gone. I can't imagine the Grandmaster is going to be very pleased with me when I get back. The Grandmaster? That's Ouroboros' leader, right? The very same. The only absolute figure to we Anguis. The supreme existence carrying out the Orpheus final plan, who will guide the souls of all. The souls of all? I don't get it. Hmm? So that's... So that's why you broke the taboo and left seven years ago. That's right. I became a guide for the second part of the Grandmaster's plan, known as the Phantasmal Blaze Plan. A plan to use the Hollow Phantasm and Crossbell to awaken the Blaze in the Empire. Regardless, thanks to you and Crow, I was able to advance it... Crow? Hole. That must be from where he was pierced during the battle. No! This isn't happening. I'll heal you right away! Help me, Selene! I'm on it! Heal him, Sun Man, same place I shot Osborne to. <laughs> Karma's a bitch, huh? Crow, you don't have to talk! Sorry, Reen. Looks like I won't be able to keep that promise after all. To Angelica and 
George are gonna have to. It's okay. It doesn't matter right now. We need to stop the blood. It's hopeless, isn't it? I'm afraid so. He's been pierced through the heart. Even our witchcraft won't be enough. The most I can do is make it as painless as possible. <sighs> it's not working! <laughs> Thanks, Emma. And you, Kitty. At least this way, I can say my goodbyes. Crow! No! No, don't talk like that! I swear, you're such a spoiled kid sometimes. Elliot, that concert was really fun. Keep on loving music, as much as I loved yours. Elisa, try and get along with your mom, all right? You've got your differences, but at least she's still alive to talk to you. Okay, okay. Machias. Yusus, stay good rivals for one another, okay? The Empire might change with the times, but you two should always be the same. <sighs> of course we will. I refuse to accept him as a friend, but I'll accept him as a worthy rival. Laura, Fee, Gaius, Milium, a lot's happened. This past year, but I really enjoyed getting to know you. So, <laughs> thanks. We should be the ones thanking you. It's been fun for me, too. You've been a wonderful classmate and comrade. Thank you for everything. I know I'm an iron blood, but it was real fun for me, too. Sarah, thanks for everything. These last two years, and Vita, a lot's happened between us, but I'm glad I had you there. <laughs> you were as much of a model student as I was a model teacher, but still, I should be the one thanking you. Hey now, <laughs> what's with the long faces? What? You were all going to be in for some <laughs> tough times ahead. I can't go any farther now. But you can. So keep going forward. Relentlessly. Without looking back. <laughs> as long as you do. I'm sure. to die before their instructors. <sighs> Spare me the sentimental drivel! Damn it all! How could I lose the Azure Chevalier at a time like this? Why must I be surrounded by nothing but disappointments? And that goes for you too, witch, and your useless society! How dare you! What do you think you're doing? I gave him my favor, and this is how he chooses to repay me? By standing in the way of my ambition? I should never have wasted my time on that waif from a fallen country to begin with. You utter scum. Please, don't speak of him that way. You're terrible. <laughs> Duke Cayenne? You will unhand him. If you continue this shameful behavior a moment longer, then I will be forced to respond in kind. Me? <laughs> Your part in this is over, witch. Uh, <gasps> no! Vita! 
Rita! Griano's? <gasps> uh huh? Rufus? What's he doing here? <laughs> oh, of course! I still have you! Thank goodness you're here, Rufus! You... You did come to help me, didn't you? <laughs> As a commoner might put it, in your dreams. What? Target in sight. What are you? Target restrained. What's going on? What's she doing? Well done. You've behaved disgracefully toward the Imperial family and brought a calamity upon the innocent people of the capital. We may both fly the banner of the Noble Alliance, but I'm afraid I can't turn a blind eye to your misdeeds any longer. As the Alliance's Chief of Staff and a citizen of Arabonia, I hereby place the two of you under arrest. No! <laughs> I see. It all makes sense now. I thought something was amiss about you from the very beginning. I just couldn't work out where you had gotten that girl from the Black Workshop. But it seems that all this time, you were just waiting for your chance, weren't you? <laughs> Why, whatever do you mean? Uh, Vita? None of this is making any sense. <sighs> oh, I get it now. Milium? What do you get? Oh boy, I feel really stupid now. I can't believe it took me this long to figure out! You're one too, right? <laughs> yeah, it sure looks that way. Thank you for rescuing His Highness. Yeah, sounds like things were a real mess in here. Captain Claire? Captain Arundel? Wait, then... Now I get it. Can't be. All this time, you were in Iron Blood? The group's primary member, in fact. Though that secret was, until very recently, kept between myself and His Excellency the Chancellor. The others knew there was a primary member, but were never told who it was. <sighs> Pretty much what he said. You should have seen my face when I found out earlier. <laughs> Wow, even you couldn't figure it out? <sighs> what is the meaning of all this? The, the successor to one of the four great houses is the former Chancellor's protege? Why? Your high position in the Noble Alliance was secured! It was only a matter of time before you became the next Duke Alborea. Why reveal this now? What could you possibly have to gain from professing your allegiance to a dead man? He would gain nothing, which is why it's rather fortunate I'm very much alive. <gasps> ah! <laughs> no! <gasps> no way. Impossible. Uh Gramps? I'm pleased to see you again, Milliam. Greetings to you as well, Class 7. And to your esteemed instructor. And to you, Your Grace. You! How are you still alive? How indeed. Perhaps the years have dimmed your eyesight, or perhaps I had a body double. Whatever the truth may be, I think that's the least of your worries right now. <sighs> All you need to know is that our loyal ally, Rufus Alborea, will be bringing the situation in Erebonia under control. And he'll do so with minimal conflict. 
while ensuring that the Noble Alliance's power is deeply diminished. That was the task I entrusted to him, and in that he shall not fail me. As ever, it's an honor to serve you, Your Excellency. <laughs> this is a dream! This has to be a dream! As obsessed as Crow was with making it happen, I had a feeling all along you weren't really dead. Did you really know? You made it quite clear that you were someone not to be underestimated, back when we were working with you regarding the situation in Liberal. <laughs> I'm afraid I haven't a clue what you're talking about. I'm amazed you can say that with a straight face. You're referring to those steam tanks and dealing with the aftermath of the Hommel incident, I take it? <sighs> but I could never have predicted you would have taken a branch of the 13 factories under your control. What exactly do you plan to do? <laughs> Is that not obvious? I'm taking over that phantasmal blaze plan of yours. And my first order of business will be sorting out the mess you left in Crossbell. I'll allow you to leave this time, witch. Slink back to your master and the rest of that brood of serpents and tell them if they even think of trying to stand in my way, I'll crush them beneath my heel. Vita? Look, wait! I'm sorry you had to see me like that. Give my regards to the Elder. And I'm sorry for the trouble I've caused you all. Please, take good care of Crow for me. <sighs> you... Vita? Could have at least given us a chance to speak as well. Um, you've all done excellent work. I see Maiden, White Rabbit, Scarecrow, and you, Jade. Thank you, Your Excellency. I'm overjoyed to see that you're alive. Can't say I honestly thought you were dead in the first place. Well, if anyone could survive being shot through the chest, it'd be you, so I did wonder. I don't imagine you intend to reveal your secret to cheating death, do you? <laughs> and rob you of such a splendid conundrum to puzzle over. This castle will return to its original form within a few hours, but our work is far from over. I'll be giving all of you new assignments. As always, I expect only the best from each of you. Yes, Your Excellency. Man, things are about to get busy. I wonder what I should do. Rufus, I want the situation here resolved within the week. As soon as you have things under control, move forward with the occupation of Crossbell. <gasps> what? With pleasure, Your Excellency. <sighs> I'm not trying to tell you the Chancellor was evil or anything. Still, there's no denying that he managed to outwit my grandfather. I'd say it's fairly normal for a student to want to avenge his master's defeat, wouldn't you? Man, same place I shot Osborne, too. <laughs> Karma's a bitch, huh? Here we go. Rain, don't! The 
that's really not a good idea! Hmm. <laughs> Why? Why are you still alive? Crow shot you! You're supposed to be dead! Father, he didn't get revenge on you! Was everything he did... Was his whole life for nothing?! Rain... Oh, Rain... That's enough. <gasps> Just as you have your reasons that guide your actions, so too does His Excellency. And I believe you factor into those reasons more than you might think. What? I pray you grow up strong and healthy. Oh, Adios, if you're listening, hear me now. Please allow this child. <gasps> I see you finally remembered the truth. I'm glad to finally see you again, my son. You've grown into a fine young man. Indeed, the Empire will soon know of the Ashen Chevalier, the hero whose brave deeds allowed us to reclaim the capital. And who better to assist me than a national hero? I'm not afraid. 